think skating is one of the most unique sports out there because of the creative ability involved and the sense of freedom you feel when you're on your board. That's why I personally enjoy skating so much. I think the feeling you get when the bombing hills are just riding around is truly unlike no other. There's just so much potential for what you can do on a board and I think the possibilities are limitless. Skateboarding is like dancing. It's an art form, right? And it's also a sport because, you know, you, like, get a workout out of it and there's competition. But it's mostly, like, what are you going to do with the obstacle that you see? Like, what trick are you going to do? Are you going to tray flip off of it? Are you going to do a kick flip off of it or what? Like, there's so many options presented to you. You can skate any type of like, style you want. No, no rules at all. It's nice to like, it's what I do after work just to unwind. I'll uh, get off and just go skate and nothing is in my mind except for skating. The locals are the most helpful people. They're always like so nice. Everyone who like genuinely skates is like the nicest person ever. Like it's really, it's a really niche community and it's like just so open and welcoming to everyone. Being around a lot of skaters, you kind of like understand more about like different people's backgrounds and like where they come from and their situations and it makes you more like I guess you could say aware and more like sensitive to those types of things. I think like teenagers or like kids our age who like look at skating online and stuff they might think it's really cool they think like the fashion is really cool and maybe they want to get into it because of any of those reasons but I think like maybe adults or people who are beginning skating kind of might think that like more experienced skaters are like bad people like they might link it with like just the stereotype of just being like almost like a hood rat or just like doing whatever like you think you're about to blah. if you don't really understand skating or the skate scene you probably see skaters as like potheads who go to the skate park to get in trouble do bad things but like so untrue but there's de yeah definitely stereotypes it's almost like people, adults might see people skating or beginners might see like people skating and be just like intimidated or upset just by the fact they're doing it because they associate it with doing other stuff like either drugs or just like trespassing or anything like that. So like when everything was shut down, it didn't really affect me or, or anything because skateboarding is a very rebellious like community. Like they jump fences and skate elementary. If anything, it motivated them to go out more because businesses were shut down, so there was nobody to kick them out. Our favorite thing to do with skating is like going around downtown at nighttime. Almost every time we go, we get stopped like once or twice by police who tell us like we should go home or we shouldn't be out. And we did have, for a little bit, we had a, um, a curfew that we were supposed to be back in by eight and then they backed it up to 10 and now they got rid of it. Um, so we get in trouble sometimes for being out or being around or they'd say like they give other reasons it's not technically illegal for us to be out but they would always try and push us to go home so we'd have to you know change our areas and stuff like that but um we usually don't get like completely stopped we just go somewhere else but it is kind of annoying that you know it's more restricted areas you can't be around as many people and some of our parents like don't let us go out as much as they would before during a normal summer I think the benefits of skating can be hidden from the casual observer, but the more you skate, I think the more you learn to enjoy the sport for what it is. Don't listen to what other people think or what other people say about you. Like skating is a creative outlet for you to like be yourself and people calling other people like posers or like putting them down. It's just like 
gatekeeping and it doesn't really represent the community um i think but yeah. yeah definitely just like do your own thing don't worry about what other people are doing stick to like if you're having fun you're having fun that's what matters i think people overthink how much people are going to judge them like people who are better at skating and if you just go out and be extroverted and actually just talk to people who are at a skate park or anything like they're always like willing to be friends with you and everything like that one of the beauties of skating in my opinion is that it's easy enough for the average beginner to just pick up and ride a board, but also challenging enough for even the best skaters. I remember landing my first ollie was probably one of the most frustrating things I've ever attempted, but I will always remember that feeling of finally landing it and the satisfaction you feel and the sound of the board just going up in the air and then landing cleanly back on the ground. Skating is definitely one of the most freeing and creative sports I've ever encountered. Unlike like traditional sports, basketball, soccer, there's no rules or limitations that you have to follow. You can do pretty much anything you want and you can even make up your own tricks. I think that's why it's such a good, healthy emotional outlet, especially for mental health problems. And when you're, when you're out on your board, it just seems like all the problems of life just disappear. And while some people might have this preconceived negative perception of skating, I think in contrast, skateboarding is an elegant sport that is therapeutic on so many levels. And the skate community and the friends you skate with are truly special and skating has brought so many people together that I think the possibilities just keep on going. If I had to describe skateboarding in one word, it would be limitless.